Good morning, everyone. It's Pastor Tim Hammy, First Assembly of God in Burlington, Kansas. It is the 18th of September. The month is almost over. Can't believe it. Um, so uh, just hope you're ready for a new week. And um, so this morning's verse is Philippians 2, 3, and 4, where it says, Do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit, rather in humility, value others above yourself, not looking to your own interest, but each of you to the interest of others. Now, that right there goes against literally uh, human's ideas. It is literally, hey, what can I get out of life? What can I do for myself but it literally says not do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit rather in humility value others than yourself not looking to your own interests but the interests of others just kind of going out of your way and maybe helping someone uh, you know uh, as a cyclist I have the opportunity uh, there's this thing that you do as you're riding your bike you You'd be riding down the side of the road and you'd be focused on riding and all of a sudden someone pulls off the side of the road with a flat tire or maybe a broken chain or whatever and you say, hey, do you need some help? And they say, yeah, I need some help. You, get up, you stop your bike, you get off, and you help them. Because that is the courteous thing. Or some, maybe someone's on the side of the road and they look like they're having a difficulty maybe changing a tire or their car's broken down or whatever. Have you ever thought about that? doing something for others not so that you get something in return but so that you do something for others what an interesting concept but and it's it says nothing do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit not so that you get praise but you're just doing you're just helping um it's, a, it's an interesting concept to this day because people are looking for the applause, the pass on the back. I remember someone says, well, they never tell me I do a good job at the job I'm doing. I was talking to somebody and I says, you know, they tell you a good job when they give you a paycheck. What? Yeah, they give you, they hand you a paycheck so they actually didn't fire you so they say that you're doing a good job. And they, they were just amazed by that comment because if they thought you were doing a terrible job, they would have fired you. But they thought they automatically should have had a, uh, a pat on the back. Um, so sometimes we, we should just do for others. Um, I remember one time that we as a church was doing a gas, we were just doing a discount on the cost of a gallon of gas and and people would come up and say, no, no, we can't do that. I says, well, you're here. We're doing this thing. So we're just doing it. And we were filling tanks of gas. And people were like, oh, thank you, thank you. You know, we're handing out bottles of water. It was, it was probably one of the most uh, fun times because we were doing not as, as applause or anything else. It was just trying to say, well, we just want to serve you. So... The verse this morning that we're dealing with is Philippians 2, 3, and 4. So get out your notebook. This is the Bible study. Put it in your notebook and it says this. Do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit. Rather, in humility, value others above yourself. Not looking to your own interests, but each of you to the, the interest of others. Write that verse out and then put an O and observe it. A Apply to your life and P, pray. And, and talking about prayer, if you have a prayer request and you're on Facebook, message me those prayer requests. I'd love to uh, put those on my prayer list. And if you are um, uh, watching on YouTube or the website, uh, email me your prayer request at b1agks at gmail.com. Um, I do have a special prayer request. Uh, gentleman that I know of in our community that is just uh, not doing so well. His name is Kiefer and I'm just going to pray for him and uh, if you just pray along with me and uh, 
that God would just touch him. Let's pray. Lord, I just thank you so much for this morning. I thank you for those who are watching now and those who are will watch later. I pray, Lord, specifically this morning for Kiefer. I pray that you just touch his body, uh, Lord, just be his strength. I pray for his family that, Lord, that you get, encourage them, be their, their peace, Lord. And, Lord, just just be with them. Show, show yourself real, Lord. I thank you for that, Lord. I pray for those... Uh, right now that uh, are watching or we're going to watch later, Lord. Give them a good day, Lord, as they start this work week, Lord, in your name. Amen. Have an awesome day. Love you guys. We'll talk to you tomorrow morning.